Welcome to Penacool.com's Language Lab. My name is Captainus123, and today we're going to learn about possessive pronouns, reflexive pronouns, and relative pronouns. Pronouns are special words that make our sentences more interesting and help us to talk about people, things, and relationships. Let's dive in and explore these amazing pronouns. Possessive pronouns show ownership or possession. They tell us who something belongs to. Examples of possessive pronouns are mine, yours, his, hers, its, ours, and theirs. For example, instead of saying, this book is Emily's, we can use possessive pronoun his. So we say, this book is hers. Using she, her, or hers, let's complete the sentence below with the correct possessive pronoun to show ownership. The mango chow belongs to sherry The chow belongs to her. That's right. The correct possessive pronoun is her. Reflexive pronouns are special pronouns that refer back to the subject of the sentence. They end in self or selves. They are used when the subject and object of a sentence are the same. Examples of reflexive pronouns are myself, yourself, himself, herself, itself, and ourselves. For example, instead of saying Samir made the cake by Samir, we can use the reflexive pronoun himself. So we say Samir made the cake by himself. Using yourself or ourself, choose the correct answer to fill in the blanks. Are you going to eat all that cake by yourself? That's right. Yourself refers to one of you. Relative pronouns take the place of nouns or pronouns. They are called relative because they show a relationship to someone or something else. They can be used to join two sentences about the same person or thing. Examples of relative pronouns are whom, whose, which, and that. For example, instead of saying, the book is interesting, I am reading book. We can use the relative pronoun that. So we see the book that I am reading is interesting. Let's do some examples. The toy is mine. In this sentence, the possessive pronoun mine is used to show ownership. She cooked the meal herself. In this sentence, the reflexive pronoun herself is used to show that she cooked the meal alone. The dog that is barking is mine. Lastly, in this sentence, a relative pronoun that is used to provide more information about the dog. Great job, my clever learners! You've learned about different types of pronouns, possessive, reflexive, and a relative pronoun. Pronouns help us make our sentences more interesting and gives us more information. Keep practicing and soon you'll be using pronouns like a pro. Thank you for visiting the Language Lab today. Try the exercises on Pentacool.com to earn points and win great prizes.